Hello, my fair maidens, and welcome now to Wednesday. How you feeling? You know, the moon just crossed over Saturn in the last 24 hours, so emotionally, I talked about this yesterday, the universe had said, time to emotionally step up to your own responsibility about your ego issues. In other words, if you didn't get clear yesterday, I'll kind of go over a little bit of this repeat. The moon in Virgo makes you emotionally very aware and very able to kind of compare your heart to what you believe. So moon in the first house is what it is in classic astrology. Moon in the first house means that you are feeling it, your heart's on your shirt sleeve, and that puts you in a great place to figure out flaws in the character and also to really just like get along with people because you're mostly just right there and ready, okay? You're available. Now, the universe has got Saturn in your sign right now, so you are reinventing yourself and growing up entirely. So in the last 24 hours, you might have been asked to emotionally take some responsibility for some of your ego issues. And if you need a clear example of that, it's kind of like, you know, let's go back to the playground with kids. You know, Bobby always picks on me, you know. That's the Virgo playing the wounded, oh, poor me. Well, you know what? Why are you hanging out with Bobby, Virgo? That's the emotional responsibility. You want to blame someone else, you want to say you're victimized, all this stuff, but at the end of the day, you're hanging out with that kid that's hitting you on the playground. So at the end of the day, it's up to you to change it. So in the last 24 hours, the universe has really been pretty strong about getting this lesson because we're in ramp up of the soul pyramid. We're all about to learn very quickly and we're getting the last little kind of things falling into place. Secondly, in the next 24 hours, I'm expecting Virgos to make a final decision about what their laws of intimacy are going to be for 2008. The sun is going to cross into Taurus in a couple of days. It's time for you to put your decision out there. Say, universe, I want an intimate relationship that treats me like this. I want people and strangers to respect these boundaries. I want people to be honest to this degree. I want to be able to trust people to that degree. You've got to tell the universe what you expect to happen. You cannot expect the universe to know for you. That is a huge myth, actually, with spirituality. That, in fact, we've been talking about this behind scenes, that the universe is going to know what's best for you and give it to you. Well, that defeats the whole purpose of being a magician and actually light casting your reality. If the universe is going to guide you, well, then let's just go do it. What's the point, right? So this is a, an important decision for you. You've got to make a decision say, universe, I expect this. And tell the universe what you expect and let it go. If it's wrong, you can change it later. You can always change your order. So in the next 24 hours, in order to move on to the next transit, please make some decisions about what you expect the universe to do when it comes to trust, intimacy, and boundaries. All right, Virgo, that's all I got for you. See you tomorrow. Live, love, be.